Hi, you guys. Welcome to another episode of Entertainment Gist here on Thav TV. And I am Bethlehem Macaulay. And you know, as usual, I go sourcing for the latest and the hottest entertainment gist, making the rounds during the week to just come and give it to you. And I know you want to hear every bit of it. So stay tuned and we will be right back. Hey there. Are you looking to record your videos, do your voiceovers and take your professional pictures? Look no further. With our state-of-the-art newsroom, photography, kitchen for our food content creators and exclusive children's studio, we certainly can deliver the best studio experience. Our carefully designed studio space can bring your diverse creative content ideas to life. We aim to consistently serve value to our customers far and wide. Come, let Tharv Media give life to your dreams. Tharv Media, a slice of infotainment. Welcome back. So starting out, we have our baby girl, Thames. She has come out to share an unfortunate uh, announcement with us. She said that she was recently diagnosed with reflux laryngitis now this is a disease that affects the vocal cord and you know for a singer that is something really sad it has forced her to cancel her shows that were supposed to hold on the 15th and 17th in birmingham and london and if we recall within the week too that was how justin bieber also came to say that he was recently diagnosed with a, a paralysis kind of illness that paralyzes one part of the face which is called ramsey hunt now, I know how, I can try to imagine how Thames would feel having to cancel shows and everything. It's not funny, especially when it attacks something that is really dear to you. And for her, that is her vocal cord. We sympathize with you, Thames, and we wish you speedy recovery as soon as possible because we want to definitely see you rocking stages as soon as possible. Now, moving on, uh, Earlier, we discussed about the Hedis Award. Yeah, that was to take place on the that is to take place on the fourth of September this year in Atlanta, Georgia. Well, the Hedis have come out to introduce to us three new categories with new nominees for those categories. According to them, these three new additions were inspired by a need for inclusiveness. Now, the uh, new additions are Best Inspirational Single, International Artist of the Year, and Digital Artist of the Year. Now, the nominees for Best Inspirational Single are Casey and Okwesili is a group with Cultural Praise Volume 1, Timmy Dakolo, Everything, Amen, Chidima with Jehovah Overdue, Mercy Chinwo with Featuring Glory with Onye Dikagi, Dunsin Ayeka with Ya yeah, and Nathaniel Bassi with You Are Mighty. And for the International Artist of the Year, the nominees are Beyonce, Chris Brown, Drake, Ed Sheeran, Justin Bieber, and Nas. And the last category, which is the Digital Artist of the Year, the nominees are Borna Boy, CK, Davido, Joe Boy, Remmer, and Whiskey. And well, like they said, this is to in the spirit of inclusiveness. So I guess they just want to make sure that nobody is feeling left behind, which of course is a good thing given everything that's going on. Next, we have Wande Cole. For some reason, Wande Cole is in the news today. Apparently, a Twitter user has come out to accuse Wande Cole of beating up his brother. Mm -hmm. the, the user said that the brother was beaten up by Wande Cole apparently because he was in his way. Although that doesn't really make sense, he says that when they call and his security team beat him up because he was blocking their way and he said that he knows his brother, his brother is a really calm type so he's very sure that his brother wasn't trying to make trouble and he was saying a lot of things and you know using words on when they call as expected. Now generally this doesn't really make sense, I mean imagine a scenario where you're driving your car and then someone is in your way and then you just get off your car and start beating up that person. A lot of things don't add up, but this is what we hear. And I don't know, it seems like this singers these days are getting involved in violence because just some days ago, I don't think it's up to weeks, um, Borna Boy was accused, his security was accused of shooting at two innocent civilians at a club, apparently because he made advances at the man's wife and the man reacted to the advances. So 
Burner Boy security resulted in shooting. Now, we don't know how true these are, but this is what is on ground. And if they are true, what does that really say about the celebrities that many people look up to? Not really nice, does it? Finally, at least some really nice news. Bilonia business tycoon Obi Kubana and his wife Ebele celebrated their 14th wedding anniversary this over the week. They shared lovely videos of them on Instagram. They were really cute. There was this one where she was like biting his ear or something like that. And then there was a photo with her and her husband kissing and the kids covering their faces. It was all cute. It was all nice. We wish them many, many more fruitful years of bliss and happiness and that is all i have for you today on the entertainment gist but stay tuned and i'll be back with the thav tv top five for the week what an opportunity what an opportunity accepted hello are you a football fan do you have a favorite team do you think you know enough about your favorite team to help you win the league well, there's only one place to find out, and that's on the Super Fan Show. So you're welcome to join me out here on the street in the Super Fan Show on TAF TV as you get to win cash and gift prizes by answering some simple questions about your favorite teams. Well, I'll tell you what, football just got more interesting, more interactive, and more entertaining right here in the Super Fan Show as you get to answer questions on your favorite team. Super Fan Show, know your team, win big. Welcome back and I'm here with the Thab TV Top 5 trending songs for the week. And at number 5 we have Simi and Adekule Gold with Balance. Now generally this is a nice vibe because it's funny how Simi and Adekule Gold seem to be blending a lot. Maybe it's marriage but even in their song they're starting to sound really alike. And that's cool. It's a nice song, Balance. It's, it's something you'd love to listen to. It's easily vibed to and I like the song. And at number four, we have Naira Mali with Montego Bay. Now, this one is quite odd. Everybody knows what Naira Mali is like. He's like the crazy person. But here, he's trying to sound more lovey-dovey. And mm, for his fans, the Malians, it might be a little odd. Even for me, it's odd because Naira Mali is not known to sing love songs in the manner that he's singing here in this Montego Bay. But... Kudos to him for trying something new. It was, it's not so bad. It's okay. It's cool. It's nice. It's nice, actually. And at number three, we have Mr. Easy with Legal Lies. This song. Yeah, you see me smiling already, right? I love this song particularly because it's just cute. The fact that um, Tenny is in the video is just amazing. And it's, it's obviously a love song to her. And... It's one that you would love to watch over and over again. If you have not seen the video, please go and see it. I really don't know what you're waiting for. And at number two, we have Fireboy DML with Playboy. You know those songs that you hear and you have to go and start searching for them to download them. This is one of those songs. It's not like there's anything so... I don't just know how they do it. There's just this catchy tune and you just have it playing over and over in your ears and you're just looking for the song this playboy is that song and at number one we have sugar king remix now this is featuring okay this is a song by kamido featuring king promise mayor kun and darko and i'm sure that as i'm saying it you're already vibing to the song in your head yes because it's like that this song particularly i heard it just heard the lyrics and i was wondering what song is if i had to like shazam it to find it. This song is nice. This Sugar Cane is a really, really nice jam. And it's, I think it's one of those songs that will stand the test of time that even come a couple years later, we could always, always vibe to it. Well, that is all I have for you today on Entertainment Gist. And until I come your way again next week, I am Bethlehem Macaulay. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, leave comments. Enjoy the rest of your day.